Well, Governor Bill Lee's stay-at-home order expired last night, and crowds are starting to come out. This is a drone force shot in downtown Franklin. Gyms and fitness centers outside of Davidson County are allowed to reopen today under 50% capacity. News 4's Chris Miller shows us how they're handling the changes. Well, I live here in Franklin, so I wanted to go out quickly today and see which gyms were actually reopened under the governor's new orders and started here at the big new Lifetime Fitness and found a completely empty parking lot. I called them up and the operator told me on the phone that they are not open and they will notify their members through email on when they're opening. We're at D1 training here in Franklin now. Looked at the parking lot. Clearly they're open right now, so we're going to go inside and talk to a manager and see what's going on. No masks. Um, we've made it optional for, for our employees and our members. Um, we're taking a lot of different precautions to um, ensure the safety of both our employees and our members by um, making sure that we're all practicing uh, social distancing. We are, uh, we've added in buffers in between our workouts so that the staff can uh, sanitize all the equipment, wipe everything down, clean the facility before the next group of people. So we're taking a lot of different precautions. And this is Iron Tribe Fitness in downtown Franklin. Now they're reopening Monday and they're using the next few days to determine what their new guidelines will be. And we'll be cleaning things before and after every single workout as well, just to make sure that it's, it's safe for our athletes. Uh, maintaining a good distance as well. Our athletes will stay in given boxes for an, for an entire class. So it's that way we can work out, but we can also be safe and, and respect the pledge. No masks. Will you be requiring people to wear masks? We're, we're not requiring it, but we are encouraging it. We will be wearing masks um, and we'll encourage our athletes to do the same. I also called the Franklin Athletic Club. They are open today. They said they're doing temperature checks at the door and requiring everyone inside to wear a mask the entire time they're there. In Franklin, Chris Miller, News 4 Nashville.